Hello my fellow Keep League Wielders and welcome back to another video, I am the Kingdom Key and in today's video for you all I have some more facts to do with Kingdom Hearts. So before we dive into the facts do me a favour and leave a like on the video if you like our facts series and also do me a favour and check out some of the other videos if you haven't had the chance or the opportunity. So let's dive in with fact number one. Coming in at number 1, the Gazing Eye, also known as No Name, is not the main keyblade of the Master of Masters. He created and briefly wielded it before passing it down to Lushu. Coming in with fact number 2, Axel bears a great number of similarities with Reno from Final Fantasy VII, even sharing his voice actor with Reno over a variety of several different languages. Tetsuya Nomura stated that in an interview done intentionally as an experiment, he wanted to place a familiar character in a new environment and role. He also stated in an interview that the two are different people but subconsciously alike. Coming in with fact number 3, a world based on Jungle Book was supposed to appear in Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep, but was removed by unknown reasons. Coming in with fact number 4, the Japanese writing of Ansem can be read as Anthem, which may be a reference to his devotion and leadership of Radiant Garden. Confusion over Ansem vs Anthem explains the title of the fourth Kingdom Hearts 2 novel, Anthem Meet Again slash Axel's Last Stand. Coming in with fact number 5, the correct way to spell Kingdom Hearts 358 over 2 days is Kingdom Hearts 358 days over 2. Coming in with fact number 6, original Kingdom Hearts 1 design documents reveal many differences between the early game concepts to those that appear in the final game. Coming in with fact number 7, Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep was supposed to be Leonard Nimoy's final acting role before retiring. However, he liked playing Xehanort and being part of the series so much he wanted to continue voice acting of which he did not consider acting or work. Fact number 8. Phil does not speak in Kingdom Hearts 3. This is because his longtime Japanese voice actor Ichio Nagai, I cannot part pronounce his name so I will put it on screen, uh, passed away in 2014. Japanese developers wanted to show respect by not replacing him. This is why Phil does not have any speaking lines within Kingdom Hearts 3. And coming in with our final fact, fact number 9. Sora's design was changed in Kingdom Hearts 3 because directors did not see well to leave it in a numbered delivery. That's why the design is a mix both between Kingdom Hearts 2 and Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance attire for Sora. So there are 9 facts that you may or may not have known about Kingdom Hearts. Uh, please let me know the facts that you did and did not know. And I hope that you all enjoyed these 9 facts. We have done quite a few facts now. Uh, I actually tallied up the other day because I got bored how many facts in total I have done and it was 101 facts, so now we've just added 9 more to that, so we've probably done, yeah, quite a lot more facts, probably about, you know, like 111 Kingdom Hearts facts now, or like a little less, but, you know, it's, it's absolutely great, and I do love doing these facts for you all, but I'm going to admit it is getting increasingly more difficult <laughs> to find facts as we have covered uh, quite a lot of facts here on the channel. Uh, I do want to thank you all for the support recently as well, you guys have been absolutely crushing it and killing it, uh, so I just want to thank you all for that as well as always, I will always forever be thankful and appreciative of all of you and your support. It is absolutely great knowing that we all get on and this community is so kind and loving towards one another and supportive of each other. Uh, that's all that I could really hope for, so thank you all for doing that and bringing a, a, a better and more positive uh, experience for me this time around when doing YouTube, so thank you all so much for that as always. Uh, so let me know about the facts that you did and did not know, uh, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed, just let me know how much you want this series to continue, uh, it really seems that all of you love the fact videos so I will continue doing so, and also do me a favour if you've not had the time, uh, please go on ahead and check out the other videos. 
And just as a quick announcement, we are taking a week break as we've finished watching the cutscenes for Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days, and um, we are going to start our Kingdom Hearts 2 Let's Play uh, next Saturday, so that should be the 29th. So that is just what I wanted to say to you all. Uh, so thank you for all understanding, uh, regular streams, aka stream let's plays will resume as normal, so Final Fantasy on Friday, uh, we might stream Spider-Man today if you are interested in that, so there you go. Thank you all for watching as always, I am the Kingdom Key, I hope that you all have a great day, may your heart be your guiding key, uh, don't let anyone put you down, stand up, stand proud and stand tall, stand for what you believe in, uh, just do what is positive for you in your life, continue doing good things for yourself and others, do the things you love as long as they affect yourself and others in your life in a positive manner and affect yourself positively as well. With that all being said, thank you all for watching. I hope that you all have a good one. So until the next video, I'll catch you all then. Peace.